Race the four leaf clover second leg. The Corley entry of Honus Highlight and Red Star Longshot were both beaten in round one. Bad Bird, a first leg winner with his wicked late burst. On the inside with perfect art. As they race to the first turn, it's Magnetic Colleen on the inside. Red Star Longshot hustling up on the outside. Perfect Art is third. Log Have Mercy got away fourth. Slug of Gin is fifth. Honus Highlight is sixth. And then it's Armbro Peregrine seventh. And eighth is Bad Burt. And they race past the quarter, and it's Red Star Longshot. The best there with Jack Moiseev. A quick 26 and three. Down the back stretch, Red Star, long shot, Jack Moiseev trying to settle things down. A magnetic Colleen under a stud hold second. Perfect Art is third as the pace slows down. And Log Have Mercy is fourth. Rushing up here comes Honus Highlight on the move up with Armbro Peregrine. And then on the inside, it's Slug of Gin with Bad Burt getting underway from the back. Over at the half, Red Star long shot hit the half in 55 and three fifths. 29 second breather there for Red Star long shot. Here comes the other half of the entry. Honus highlight to challenge on the outside. Magnetic clean in the pocket now and hemmed in on the outside. Trying to get into it is Armbro Peregrine now second over fourth, followed by Bad Burt gearing up now fifth on the outside. Perfect Art on the inside, sixth, and then it's Slug of Gin and Log Have Mercy. They're at three quarters in the entry, stride for stride. Honus Highlight now takes the lead, 124 and one, but digging in Red Star Long Shot. Red Star Long Shot, Honus Highlight, and on the outside, Armbro Peregrine, and here comes Bad Burt. Live between horses, Magnetic Clean trying to come on. Honus Highlight, Bad Burt on the outside is coming, and it's going to be Bad Burt. Up the cones comes Magnetic Clean. Bad Burt, two for two in the four-leaf clover, and that gives Ron Pierce his third winner of the night. The entry gets cooked, and this Albert, Albert five-year-old, has emerged as one of the top pacers of the meet here at the Big M. Didn't figure to have much chance under tonight's speedy conditions, but storms home last to first for a new lifetime mark. Back-to-back, -back Pelling and Daly, Bad Burt now five for nine this season for the Peter Pan Stables.